evening. I'm Suraj, and with me is Shad. Today, we're going to explain the TMJ, temporomandibular joint, its clinical examination, and what it is. So this is a simple picture of the TMJ. It's a genioarthroidal joint. It's vascularina cosa, the condyle, and it has an articular disc in between it. And to move the condyle, we'll take some pointers. So now I'm going to show you about the clinical exam of the TMJ. The first step is to take a detailed medical history, which I'm going to simulate now. Okay, I've just got a few quick questions for you. Do you have any discomfort when you're eating or chewing? Uh, no. Do you have any discomfort when you're talking? Uh, never. Have you ever heard that your jaw clicked, or have you ever suffered from locked jaw? No. Never? No. Okay, perfect. Bilaterally, in front of the openings of the ear, a couple of millimeters in front, you should feel a bony protuberance. Then ask your patient to open wide. Open wide, please. As far as you can. You should feel the movement of the condyles in the fossa. Can you close, please? It should be the same movement. You're going to ask them to open one more time, and you're going to listen for clicks or any other irregularities, and you're going to palpate as well. Can you open again, please? Can you close? Perfect. The next movement I'm going to check is right and left lateral excursion. I'm going to start with the right. Can you open your jaw, please? Okay, can you move it all the way to the front? You should be feeling the right condyle stays in place, and the left one is always in place. So it's slightly leaves the fossa in there. So the right one should be in the fossa the whole time. Okay, can you close your jaw? Can you open again, please? Can you move it all the way to the left side? The left lateral excursion. The left condyle should be inside the fossa, and the right one should be orbiting. Okay, can you close your jaw, please? Thank you. So now I'm going to palpate the master muscle. So can you bite down as hard as you can? You should feel, just uh, in front of the premolar area, there's a hard muscle. You should be feeling for any irregularities, any problems, and you also should check the temporalis muscle to see if there's any knots or any irregularities. Okay, thank you for listening, and we hope you enjoyed our video. Do you have any problems when you're eating? No. No. That's a good sign. Second sign is, do you have any problems opening and closing your jaw? Do you ever hear any clicking or any other sensations? 